Okay, so I want to leave this in the backdrop, uh, what we're doing here, but we'll get going on to it in a second. I'll turn it on. Uh, but again, here's my new business card. You know, we're just going to hand that to you. It's got my name, a number, and everything on it. It's just a little cubic space, strong force, weak force, uh, electromagnetism, and gravity, of course. Being this uh, particle design, a manscaper, the landscaper, chest of 40K, uh, the ball, photon ball. Uh, in changing fields, air, water, fluoromonium acid, and 1 over K to what it's going to break down to be. Well, seeing that that's the uh, Knights game, or the, excuse me, the Masons game, the Knights tour, the Rooks tour, or the Black Bishop gambit, right? So in here, you know, then the backside's about what's up and some login of some points there. It's a login. But I wanted to get this up because this slides into my Warhammer table. A little bit obviously my whole uh, my variants on the ASVAP for Alice and Bob and Dave's PRT and the whole well this being the the log for the extruder the the geometry uh, schematics that you'll need the the crypto that you'll need the general relativity crypto the stuff that you can be looking at and don't even know that it's an issue like this whole field Shangri-La in the background time see that's a bit of the problem in the nature of we'll just flash back to the salty heart rate monitor and him banging around about what we'll be getting into for here of when you want to first set up your character card what's the game well it's yellow phase right you're just in a group of hillbillies out there it's like okay boys let's let's set this up the strong force test is push-ups sit-ups runs and constitution well nobody has any chains and rails inside of this as far as well it's two minutes of push-ups two minutes of running or excuse me two minutes of sit-ups back to back two minutes of running then you hang off a bar for two minutes right and that's eight minutes of test and whoever can do it will graphic out the dot metrics and that is the strong force here being the weak force test is push-ups sit-ups run testing and constitution if we have to square things out or if you feel like just off of the ih you might not want to do that the push-up test is going to be uh n plus p equals log one obviously our first results under all the students or numbers the uh n uh the two on this is going to be n plus p1 plus p2 equals log two uh, three is n plus k equals log which could be diamonds which could be wide push-ups uh, the variance of p1 plus p2 testings um, x plus y is the the standardized test that's why i skipped it and broke it down at the fractal level to n plus k i over p no um, i think it's the angling angle in the squared position plus k n over m being Lejeu, log one, log two, log camp, Lejeu. Um, the sit up set on this are going to be uh, uh, full sit ups, crunches, crosses, and negatives. Why? Because those are the three setups again in that same setup, different with just a regular list. Why not? Run testing, I've broken down two quadrants as far as the jump, and I want you to matrix out the O type stars on a Hubble 45. Um, okay, so not the cleanest thing, but that's a lot of dot metrics, and you'll be doing as far as the weak force is concerned. Um, real, real important, constitution, mass, learning curve, Bell's inequality, and field theory. Now, what we can get into is a whole subset of a bunch of other things, but I'm pretty sure that that covers a lot of the material before we get into a chemistry set or a psychology class, any real graphicing inversion to a term which again everybody can then vote on before I'll just go chemistry set uh, toolkit CNC machine definitely got to have a some kind of bit farm going on and there's got to be a test to setting that up and getting one going and then seeing how good you can do with it in order to figure out the limits in which to test somebody else to then compare against yourself to figure out where they'll hold that whole thing fits out in the universe as a combinationable functional permutation of the sets that might have exclusive tendencies about them for their mutual behaviors. <laughs> Anyways, catch you on the next one.